Hello and welcome to Romero Threads on YouTube. Today's video is very, very special being that it is going to be my daughter's first birthday in a couple days. So I wanna go ahead and personalize some bib and a t-shirt for her. So my daughter, one years old, okay? So this is the 12 months. So let's take it here to the GoPro so you could kind of have a bird's eye view. All right, so this is my design here for today. All right, so this is from Designs by Juju here, my first birthday. So I'm planning to put this one on a bib. And this one's a basic applique. And I have the infant station here, which is very easy to work with. So for stabilizers, I like to use Performance Cutaway. And I use these for polo shirts, for the thin type polo shirts. Okay, so it works good for baby shirts too. And this just avoids the shirt being so bulky during the stitching. So real quick, I'm going to make a shirt. This is 12 months and you'll see how easy, okay, how easy it fits through here. Okay, so it fits nice and snuggy. Okay, but not to the point where it's going to stretch out the shirt. So here at 12 months shirt, this is perfect. Okay, then you could see your centering. And have my twill, my pink, and my navy blue as a background. All right, let's go ahead. Let's hoop the bib. All right, so I'm going to use my bibs here. These are from Rabbit Skins. I like bibs because they're easy to work with and for children, especially if you have heavy stitching, you don't have to worry about the bib rubbing on the skin too much. So I have my stabilizer, same stabilizer that I used before. And then this tag here, you can kind of move it to the side just so it doesn't get embroidered on, all right? And then you could hoop it like a shirt too. And once you see that you're straight, bam, good to go. So let's check this out, look at this. Came out very nice here. Okay, look at that. So I'm trying to show you every angle of the stitching. Perfect, perfect stitching. Okay, so we are completed with our stitching. Let's see how it came out. So this one, this is the bib. So before I take it off the hoop, this is how it's looking so far. Looking very, very clean. Okay, and our backing, nice and, nice and tight back there. And as you can see, I had to do a double hoop. So I did this top part first and then this name second. And as you can see, The letters came out nice and crisp. So let's go ahead, let's take it off the hoop and let's check it out. All right, so all we gotta do, all we gotta do is just clean it up here. I like to cut the cutaway, give it at least a quarter inch. Okay, but this shirt is ready to go for the birthday girl. And then you could always add some stuff here if you want to add names and everything. I think this looks nice the way it is here. Look at that. Very clean. Very clean. All right. So I'll leave the description. I'll leave the design information down below just in case you want to try these out. All right. There you go. Thank you for hanging out with me today. And like always, subscribe, hit that like. 
and leave all your questions down below. Thank you very much. Peace out.